What is up, YouTube? It is your boy John here from Puma Plow playing some more Railroader. Let's get to it. All right, so we're here at Bryson City. And, uh, well, there, there's a tree. Uh, there might just be, um, a couple of cars here. And when I say a couple of cars, well, there might just be a couple of cars. Uh, I'll be honest, what's going on? How are you? Oh, yeah. Spider Venom, what's poppin'? How are you? Uh, it's a whole smorgasbord. It's a whole rainbow of colors of where the cars go. But if you notice, they're sorted. All right. They are sorted. So, uh, first things first, we got to, like, you know, start building trains and getting some stuff. Actually, I got to get that car out of there, too. I got to do some Bryson, Bryson work. So, I think the first thing I was going to accomplish was probably oh i thought that was an engine i was like yeah get that engine going that's a tanker um john yep uh this engine right here so this engine needs to go to robinson coal and it can push the the stuff to robinson coal and uh yeah so we need to get this engine fired up and moving davison the lake just resubscribed for 28 months holy frame rate Actually, Dave, it's not, it's a little, it's bad. Okay. Yeah. You're not wrong. Dave, thanks for the 20, uh, month, three, seven, two, three. Do appreciate it. How's it going? Yeah, so like, you know, 25 frames, this isn't great. Right. <laughs> it's pretty gnarly. All right. So let's line this train out of here. Uh, we got to check up here too. Cause I don't think this is going to be right for it. Actually, that, that looks good. Okay, so back to our CTC board so we can give it some uh, green lightage. Uh, we want it to uh, probably just hold at Alarca on the main line, but just hold there because we have to go for that switch. Plus, our passenger train's actually out there too. So there's uh, there is that after all. So all good. Work has been life lately. Yeah, just chilling, hanging out, you know, <laughs> having some bad frame rate. <laughs> just another day, another bad frame rate, you know? Oh, man. It's pretty, yeah. Trent was seeing like seven frames last time he was in here, so. Although that was before the update. That was before the update, so I don't know. He hasn't been in here since the update, so I don't know uh, what he was getting out. Okay, this engine... I kind of wouldn't mind getting this engine to go get some... Um, uh, what's it called? I need to find a place to set this where I'm not going to knock this over. Yeah. yeah, you guys didn't hear that. It's fine. <laughs> Knocking everything over out here today. Uh, but Trent hasn't been in this map, I don't think, since the update. So I'd be curious to hear how bad his frame rate is here. Yeah, when they start moving, though, Dave, that's when it <laughs> really gets bad. Uh, yeah, okay, Mama Llama. Mama Llama, welcome in. West Path, and how you doing today? Okay. Anyway, I want to get this engine some coal. And I wouldn't mind turning it around too, but definitely coal. So, yeah, I think to old old, there's probably, well, before I sent that train out of here, somewhere in the neighborhood of a hundred and probably 50 ish, 140 ish cars. Um, is what I'm, uh, what I'm thinking, but you can tell at times it is, it is incredibly framey still. <laughs> So I love the idea of getting everything to Bryce in here and sorting it off like this, but gameplay wise, I don't know about it at the same time because it gets so leggy. I love the idea. I just, yeah, I don't know. Yo, let's go Mama Llama GG's on selling the old house. 
That's pretty awesome. And then, yeah, if I bring up the tags, it gets even worse. So there's 28 frames. I mean, not like with without the tags, it's much better. 33, so. Yeah. It's not great anywhere. Oh, man. Okay, I need to find... Oh, I know where it's at. Okay. All right. Uh, Black Cat, thanks for the bits. Appreciate, appreciate them. Uh, I need to get engine number one back in here because there's stuff like, you know, that car that needs to come out of here before I can send my uh, my mainline freight on its way. So we'll have to find that engine. It's back at Appalachian Hardwood, I think. Oh, I forgot to look into those mods, by the way. There's mods that change this map, and I, I haven't messed with them. I was sent them, but I forgot to uh, forgot to look into that. Probably should have. That's okay. We will be just fine without them. Yeah, by the way, I did laugh at the title because I, you know, that's a Sean, it's a Sean title, so. I chuckled at it when I saw it today for the first time. Right? Meow. Uh, unfortunately, our safety rating is probably going to go down. Uh, and not probably. I know it's going to go down because we had two incidents so far in this in-game day. So our safety rating is going to uh, plummet some more, which is so much fun. But it is what it is, you know? I can't do much about it, so. When I send it way too hard with the steam engine. <laughs> you know, things things happened, okay? This car still didn't change over. This car's literally at point one. I've been waiting for this car to change over, but I'm not waiting any longer, so we're just going to out of way and uh, I don't have the right is that the right no what controls the, oh that's for that engine over there duh let's uh, bring up the right controls for this engine huh yeah but anyway we need these cars out of here to get them on our interchange trains so whatever it's time let's go cars are getting loaded it was at like one point something. I swear. I don't know. Whatever. Not my, uh, not my problem. How about that? I'm just going to take what we got. Just going to take what we got and get on. Get on out of here. Go on. Get now. Because if nothing else, I really do need to get the interchange trains out of Bryson. Uh, to help with lag. So... Cause over here, man, I'm getting a beautiful 60 FPS. This is great. <laughs> the trees are actually swaying. They don't look choppy, you know? <laughs> uh, oh, man. All right, I know I have an oil car on board, but there's not another one by chance, is there? No, okay, good. All right. So yeah, we gotta get the Silvas onto what I call Trent's train. And the entries on uh, on my train here. That'll be fun. It'll be a good time. Oh, Alex, that is true. We should find out today if the safety rating can go negative. Yeah. Our frames are cut in half already, by the way. We're down to about 30. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh my goodness. I need to go do sawmill stuff too, but you know. One thing at a time. I'm going to try to focus a little more today. I, I get so scatterbrained in this game. I'm like, ooh, shiny. Ooh, a squirrel? No, let's finish this Bryson stuff, John. Jace. Because the sawmill's not affecting getting the interchange trains moving. So. Especially the uh, Andrews train, because it takes so long to go to Andrews that we, you know, need to get that train moving. 
because that's going to be our holdup most likely uh, for the day. So if we get that train rolling, then uh, won't hold us up anymore. But we got a we got a couple. We got to get that car out of there before we uh, before we can send that train. But that's okay. And let's see. Actually, how are these trains in here again? I need to put those cars on there. Okay, we can do that. Need to get on the other side of this front car. Honestly, I need to get on the other side of all of these cars. I don't think there's enough room to jump around there. I could kick them, but, you know, I'm trying not to kick cars as much because, uh, well, I don't know how that ends. <laughs> so... <laughs> I'm trying not to kick cars as much, all right? I swear. Uh, after the other. Yeah. 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 All I got to say about that. And then actually, this engine's going to go off to Ella eventually and do the Ella car. There's one Ella car sitting up here. Ready to go. So. We'll get that moved out eventually as well. Alrighty. Go ahead and lock those down. Cut loose from them. Go. We'll jump over a couple tracks. So on Tuesday when I was sorting stuff in here, I literally got to the point where I'm like, there is not a single... There was not a single open track here at Bryson. Every single track had stuff on it. So... It was uh it was a bit interesting, kind of the seesaw you have to play of like, oh I gotta move this train this way to be able to jump these cars over and all that kind of stuff. It was fun though, I enjoyed it. I played for a couple hours probably to get Ella uh looking like Ella Ella looks right now, so Wow. It was a good couple hours to get it all all sorted. Because I was playing my map, Trent was playing his map. The fries are done, apparently, Trent. So, you know. Uh, CBM, what's going on? How you doing today, man? Welcome in. What's popping? Hopefully everybody's having a great uh, Friday. It's good Friday, isn't it? Good Friday. Bunch of them. All right, so we'll spot that one car over to there. We'll spot the three here. And we'll go get that car. We might have to pull that whole train up a little bit, which is fine. That uh, Silva train's hooked to the double diesels plus the uh, the switcher. So it's got plenty. Plenty, plenty, plenty of power, you see. So. Tomcat, what's going on, man? How you doing today? Happen. All right. Chugga chugga chugga, let's go. Oh, yeah, nothing like the old Bryson, uh, the Bryson sort. The Bryson shuffle, if you will. The Bryson shuffle. And then we got to do all the Bryson cars, too. We got we got all those to uh, spot back at, you know, Appalachian Hardwood and stuff. We got all these cars to, all those cars to mess with, so... But before I do that, I'm getting these interchange trains out of here so I get some frame rate. I think that's uh, the most important thing right now is get these interchange trains moving so we can get a little bit of frame rate back. But that's okay. It's all good. It's all good. Where are Trent's at today? He said he was going to be here. But he is... That is uncle got him doing something today. I had to guess. Right. Yeah, so we're going to go all the way over first. Okay. You betcha. He keeps these here and come. Oh. I thought I saw him drop earlier, and I was like, oh, okay, maybe it's just a bad day for the old Starlink, huh? 
I know my Wi-Fi at the house today is like really dodgy for some reason. I just said dodgy. Terrible? It's really bad. I don't know why. I like my I keep losing uh I keep losing my security cameras for some reason today. Because you know, they all run on the Wi-Fi, so Yeah, we're kicking a car, I know. I just said before I wasn't gonna kick cars. It's fine. It's just one and it's going slow. So it doesn't matter. Your cable dropped last night. Interesting. I actually, speaking of like weird things last night, I found an email from my internet company last night. That apparently I had opened, but I guess I didn't, uh, I don't remember it. So there's that, but apparently they lowered my bill like a while ago and I didn't know it. <laughs> I was like, well, all right. I mean, I could have complained. Yeah. They lowered my bill and I was like, okay, I'm, I'm here for that. Okay, so we want to go here, and then here, and then there, and then back there. Okay, let's go. But yeah, they lowered my bill, and I was like, all right. That's cool. I don't mind that. It wasn't a lot, but still, they, lo you know, lowered the bill. I, the more, the longer I have this internet company, the more I'm impressed with just how they, how they operate as a company, man. It's, it's so different than uh, Spectrum, which was, you know, our only option back in the day was Spectrum. So it is very, 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 very different than Spectrum. That's for sure. Which is very, 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 very nice that it's not Spectrum anymore. Uh Spectrum was so bad. All right, we're going to park that train for just a second. We're going to grab this guy here. Go ahead and bring him back for uh, water. Because why not? And it's like, that's some water, but might as well fill it up. We're here. We're right there. Not a big deal, though. Not a big deal to do that. Right, let's go grab that one car. And then I think we can send the interchange trains. Although I kind of can't send the interchange. I can send one. I can send Trent's. At least to Bryce or to uh, Whittier, I think. Problem with the... Uh, well, I can kind of... Yeah. That engine that we just put for water, it needs to grab the Alarca cars and take those up to Alarca. Oh, that's spicy. Okay. I was trying to get a crumb off my mouse pad and almost had another crash. Uh, I felt a crumb, okay? There's nothing worse than a crumb on your mouse pad, all right? Just saying. But, um, yeah, that other that train that's filling up with uh, water right now needs to grab the Alarca Junction, or the Alarca cars. And take those to Alarca, and then after both those engines are done, so the one at Robinson Cole and the one at Alarca, once they're done, then we put them on the Robinson uh, cars to head out there. Because I think we're going to need all four Brookshires to climb the hill. There's two out at uh, Nantahala. And then we'll have two more going there. So I think I think we're going to need all four uh, to climb the hill with, with and, and try to get it all in one shot, you know? Which is what uh, I really want to do. I want to try to get everything up there in one, one shot and not have to go multiple times up and down the hill. Because that is killing our efficiency. Uh, for the record. Absolutely just murdering our efficiency. So yeah. Alright, I am going to have to pull that train up a little bit. So, Not a big deal. And actually that train I might just go ahead like I said and send it. I know Trent's wanting to drive it, but 
Tran's not even in TeamSpeak right now, so he must be having some internet issues uh, today. So we'll just go ahead and send his train on AI, at least to Whittier for now. Not sure. I don't think there's cars at Whittier for him, though, or for that train. I think he grabbed him on his way here, uh, if I'm not mistaken. But let's move this up just a smidgy bit. And yes, it's already out of the yard at Bryson. <laughs> Just like a little bit. No. No big deal. Uh I guess the only thing that's keeping me from actually sending this is is there anything? I don't think there's gonna be anything up here. And if there is, it's not going to be uh, that much, right? Okay, so that's an Andrews car. So not worried about that for his train. Ah, there's two, but I'm really not worried about those. And then what's up here at Robinson Cole? Okay, there are cars, but they are all Andrews. Okay, so yeah, we're just gonna send uh we're we're just gonna send Trent's uh train. Just gonna send it. Full send. Full send or no send. Um, why are these last three cars? Did I not hook them up? Oh I did, they're just taking forever to bleed. Okay. All right, let's take that off and pull this up a little bit. And yeah, it takes a little bit of power. Maybe it is a smidge. Big deal. Not to, it, the funny thing is the front of the train is going like two miles an hour before the back of the train even moves. Just for the record. All right, we're going to send that, but we're going to kind of keep it slow because I don't know... Like at Ella, if there's cars there, I don't know. We'll just send it kind of slow up the up the track. No big deal. All right, like the big thing is get it out of Bryce so we get some frame rate. Seventeen frames. Kill her with all these cars. That's okay. We'll just look this way, and then we get frame rate back. All right, let's push this one up to the train here. Yeah, I'm out. Actually, I should have brought his train back. Apparently, the fries are done again. Uh, but if I would have brought his train back, I could have slipped this one out, taking this one to Ella real quick. But... That's okay. Um, okay, so this train can actually chill um, right on this track for a minute. We're going to grab that other Berkshire and get it going to... Uh... Oh, Silva. No. Alarka. Somewhere up there. Cause it's full on, yeah, full on water, full on coal. So, there we go. All right, so we need to grab these cars here. And get them out of here as well. I really should turn the engines around too. Turn this one around, but whatever. It's going to be a hodgepodge over at uh, Andrews. They're going to be four engines and they're all going to be mismatched. But that's okay. No big deal. Doesn't really matter. It's just a personal thing, to be honest. All right, let's get these cars out of here too, huh? Oh. 
doesn't help when you stop like 20 feet shy, but hello. Yolo. Alright, let's get this one going reverse. And we'll have to change this, otherwise it'll go for coal and water. I want that, obviously. Okay. Have to change some lights again. We'll handle that train here in just a minute. Um, we'll hold that train at Ella for now. The other train. And then speaking of Ella, let's go get this one going. To grab that Ella car. And headed over to Ella. Mother Barry, it's Gold Man. How are you doing today? Welcome in. What's poppin'? And Polar Bear coming in Polar with a night. Polar Bear 8510 just resubscribed for 19 months. Forgot Brian was going to talk, to be honest. Uh, Polar Bear coming in with a 19 month resub. Do appreciate it. Do appreciate it. I honestly I forgot Brian was going to speak there. <laughs> All right, Brian. It's funny. Hope oh, all is well, Polar Bear. All right. We need to grab the car all the way over here. Be this one. Go to Ella. Go to Ella. Here, yeah, Bacho. Wanted to resub and say hi. You have a birthday supper to go to. Well, happy birthday to whoever's birthday it is. I don't know. Is it yours? Is it? I don't know. You don't have to tell me. But, you know, happy birthday to whoever it is. Hope they have a good day. All right, forward on. Let's go. Get all of our switches set to get this out of here. By the way, I actually, I didn't do it. Trent did it the other night. We actually used this, this track here. We stashed a bunch of uh, Robinson cars. We stashed a bunch of Robinson car, cars up there. Just to, or not Robinson, uh, Andrew's cars. Just to get them out of the way. Oh, yours is next Tuesday. Dang, Polar Bear. That sounds like April for my family. There are four four uh, birthdays in April in my family. That's, that's crazy. Crazy, crazy. All right. Oh, man. Look at all these frames we get now here at Bryson. We're getting a whole, like, 35. We were getting... Like 18. <laughs> so. Oh, <laughs> uh, you're saying there's a chance, huh, chat? All right, let's grab this guy. And we can manually drive this. I don't mind that. Or, you know, if I hit the right button, there we go. All right. Let's ride with this car. We're going to Robinson Cole, which has a new color now, and it's kind of weird. Around this time, it gets crazy for birthdays, yeah. All right, Polar Bear, have fun. We'll uh, we'll catch you later. Appreciate the resub and run. <laughs> oh goodness, that's funny. 
Three sub and run. This game looks easier than Train Sim World 4. Never played that one, but this one, um, it has its challenging moments, but it's it's fun. It's mostly just, you know. Well, the the hiring of the trains really uh, makes this game a lot, a lot. It's nice. It's it's a lot nicer to have being able to like hire, hire out your trains and 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 run them on AI, especially what they did with the passenger trains. That's really nice on AI, because uh, it'll stop at every station for you that you have check marked on the car, and it'll just go do its thing, which is great. Um, fun game though. I really highly, 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 highly recommend this game. It's so much fun. I enjoy it a lot. The multiplayer experience is pretty nice as well. And I'm sure whenever Trent shows up or his internet comes back, he'll uh, he'll be joining us. Normally Trent's in here with us, and Sarge will come join us. And yeah, it's it's a good time. So uh, right now I'm in here by myself, but I have I'm running this engine that's pushing these cars technically right now. I've got three other engines running, so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's up to allegedly like 32 people multiplayer, but there's no way. It would be so stinking laggy. There's there's no way. So about, about three to four people is probably good for at least what we're doing right now on this, this particular save. Of course, we're trying to get our safety rating higher. So we're, we're AIing a lot more because the AI like drivers they don't crash um so our safety rating might be um eight right now and there has been some incidents in this in-game day so our safety rating is going to go down unfortunately uh but by ai and a lot more of it i'm trying to get my safety rating back up so we can get better contracts and make more money and like you know maybe pay off that ninety six thousand dollar loan that we have this maybe, uh, but that's okay. We bought a lot of engines and stuff, so it'll it'll take time. But we should get we should get out from under that that loan. I think Trent had one hundred and sixty thousand dollars on his map. He took out the loan and he got back out out from under it. And he's you know he's debt free now in his, I believe. So it is possible. It just takes time. Definitely, definitely is going to take us some time, but that's all right. It's all good. But we finally have enough engines to actually pull some cars up to Andrews. Four of the, the biggest steam engines in the game, so. Yeah, <laughs> so that'll be nice. That'll be that'll be a good time. We'll, we'll get to run those actually today for the first time up the hill all in one shot. We've run three before, uh, but this time we're going to have four steam engines out there. Big steam engines, the Berkshires. Uh, we're gonna have four of them hooked up and running to try to get uh, get up there in one shot. Basically, I'm tired of uh, I'm tired of having to leave leave cars behind, split the train, and you know take so many cars and then come back and take. I'm, I don't. I'm tired of doing that. I want to make it one run and be done. You know, that's what I want to do. So that's what we're gonna do. Plus, this game has some cool stuff. We have a CTC board uh, for, you know, running running all the signals and stuff. And that's pretty cool. I like that a lot. I can show you that here in a minute. Because I need to go flip some CTC actually here in just a second. Because that the second train I sent is going to, yeah, it's holding at Bryson. So we got to get it out of Bryson. So I'll have to go. I'll have to go give it some green lights here in a second. But. I might as well spot these cars where they go real quick because I'm here, so. But yeah, the CTC is pretty fun. Now, unfortunately, you don't get the CTC right off the hop. You actually, uh, well, not unfortunately, actually. You have to unlock it, basically, which is cool. There's milestones you do. You have to, like, buy, and then it gives you a car to haul to a, a place, and you spot the car, and you're good to go. That's pretty cool. All right, that one train made it to Ella. We got trains everywhere right now. It's pretty cool. I probably have like, I don't know how many cars moving. I'm not sure how many cars are on that uh, diesel, on the diesel trains. It's probably a good like 60 or something. 
I'm not sure. But yeah. All right, so we'll throw these up here and then uh, we can go flip some switches at the CTC real quick. And then uh, I kind of wouldn't mind those getting a little farther. Farther up there. Come on. Come on. I probably have to move the rest of them to the other. There you go. That's far enough. Probably. Oh, I messed up. I didn't realize I had a. Uh, I got to put that in a different place. Okay. Uh, before we do that, though, let's get that other train moving. So this is our CTC board. Um, I guess that train's not stuck. It is stuck in Bryson. Why is it stuck in Bryson? It should. Oh, because I left that switch open. I, it's me. I'm the problem. It's me. That light won't go either. Well, that light's right. Okay. Uh, hang on. I left a switch open down here. Hi, it's me. I'm the problem. It's me. It's this one right here. That's the one holding up the show. Because watch, here's the train sitting. Sitting right here. And it won't leave the yard until I give it the green. And now that, that switch is closed up there, it'll... Page to a green light, it'll head on its way. This is going up to Alarka with the uh, the coal cars and such. That's where that's going. Go back to Robinson Coal for a minute. And actually, okay, all the cars will fit on the one line, which is good. But like I said, I got that car I need to... Needs to move move that one one car over the supply car goes uh, over here so we'll just change a few switches here and uh, roll on back and take care of it real quick not a big deal not a big deal and of course it's right in the middle too that's kind of awkward which means I don't know which ones of these cars spawned at Silva and which ones spawned at Andrews. But that's just where they met. Because the way I sorted uh, the trains, basically, I had, like, the Andrews train I pulled in from the west side of Bryson and then sorted it from the east side. So I just backed into different sidings, you know. And then same thing with the Silva train pulling from the east side and then back, pull through the, you know, through Bryson and then back cars off. Uh, to sort, so. But it's all good. This only take but a minute. Nothing back here to hit, right? Or clear. Okay. Just never hurts to check. Never hurts to check. Alright. Much independent. Too much independent. Alright, lock it up. Go forward. Forward. This is all on a hill up here, so, you know. It takes a bit of a second sometimes. A huge deal. Righty. We're just going to hit the old tab button here to see where that car goes. It goes right there, so we'll go ahead and lock them up. Unhook. Be on our way. Come on. And no, I don't put handbrakes on cars. I don't put handbrakes on. You can. But then you have to remember to take them off when you want to move again. So. I don't do it. But to each their own. Alright, let's go ahead and pull these back up into here. Where they belong. I just know. I'm just sitting here thinking like, man, I got like six other trains that are waiting on me to like do stuff. Oh well, that's fine. 
It's fine. The worst part about this game is that the clock runs at a one to one scale. That's just like the as as you know, you can go one to one, that's as slow as you can make time run in this game, right? And to be honest, one to one, there's there's too much stuff to do in a, in an in game day. You know, if you actually want to get everything done um, in an in game day, you almost need more time. And we're not even really doing everything right now either. We're doing most things, but we're not doing everything. Yeah, it, it gets, it gets, uh, actually let's back into those and then we can just, we'll be the right way when we go down. Yeah, we'll just back into these, but it gets, uh, it gets overwhelming. There's so much stuff to do, you know, Kimmy, what's popping? How's, uh, how's MLB the show? Give me after a little while you get, I'm going to, I'm going to do something on this game for the first time, by the way. For the first time going to Andrews, uh, I'm going to be running four Brookshires on a, on a train. Don't be a little bit yet. Cause I got stuff to go to, uh, to, uh, what's it called still, but yeah, it'll be the first time though. So that should be fun. It's kind of windy outside chat. It should be kind of fun. Watching the Braves today. Nice. You know, I, I, I haven't watched any baseball yet. There's not really much of a surprise for me, to be honest. All right, is our other train? Okay, so this train's going to have to go hold short somewhere for now, which is fine. Um, we need to go over to Ella. Okay, so this train, let's AI this. AI this train. And let's see, it can go to the Alarca Junction. Need that train to go up that way. Yeah, it's on the reverse. Okay. Okay, so it's going to sit at Alarca. Which is fine. Let's go check switches down here at the junction for... Uh, Oh, what's to call it? I'm on your phone. I've been demoted to the phone. Man. It's a hard knock life. Or a it's a hard knock life. I'm kidding. I mean, thank you for being here, Kimmy, and, you know, having me on your, on your phone at least, you know, somewhere, right? I appreciate it. <laughs> oh, goodness. All right. That uh, train's going to come up yonder here. And it's just a drop and go here at. Uh, um, yeah, drop and go. That's all it's going to do. So if we set this so it'll stop there, that's fine. That's where we want it to go. No big deal. And then engine uh, two will handle those cars after that. So not a big deal. Okay. Um, where's our passenger train by now? Is he caught out here? That's not our passenger. Train. That's our passenger. Train. Okay. He's doing his thing. All right. That's fine. Let's go to um, Ella. I know I have an Ella car to spot in here. Can we don't look at this train, by the way? Don't just just don't look. Can we? This is Trent's train, okay? This is this is Trent's train. Don't look at it, Kimmy. Please, just, just don't. The Braves come first. Shot through the heart, huh? Man. 
All right, so this is Trent's train, as I've been calling it, and I forgot that it has Whittier stuff on it. Adam, what's going on, man? How you doing today? So it's off to Whittier now. There's nothing here at uh, Elephart, so it can go away. Hey, okay, bye. Have a good time. Or something, right? All right, is that other train moving, or is that? Where's number one? What are you doing, number one? Number one. Your problem. Oh, you know what? I got Bryson lined for the main line, don't I? There we go. There we go. Okay, bye. Have a good time. Uh, he's not here right now, Kimmy. And like, normally he's in Teamspeak. Like his his you know account is in Teamspeak, but he uh, has been liking out a bunch and then he's just not here right now. So I don't know if he's having internet trouble or I, I don't know. I don't know, but he is not here currently. So yeah. So I guess you could say slacking. I don't know. If anything, he's probably, um, probably doing stuff for his uncle. Uh, but I don't know, you know, his like boss, but I don't know. I thought he said last night he would be here today. So I don't, I'm not sure. Uh, what are these? These are sawmill cars. All right. Should probably spot those in, huh? And then I could get that car out, but like, yeah, well, you know what? We're here. We might as well, right? We're already here. Let's just grab it. Let's just grab it. All right. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's going on. Yeah. He'll be here eventually. I'm sure. So it's all good until, until then we'll just use AI on his train, you know, just remember AI doesn't crash. Uh, I crash. AI doesn't crash. The same. All right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. All I know is I could, that that crash the other day was so bad. I was embarrassed. Okay, it was that bad. That was terrible. All right, come on. Let's, uh, I guess we'll kick that car out of here, huh? I don't know how I feel about kicking cars these days, but yellow. It's one car. There's nothing for it to hit. Might as well kick it. Go, go, gadget. Go, go, gadget. It helps if I flip the switch hard, huh? Still saying. All right. Let's go. What's my safety rating? You don't want to know. You want to guess? Do you want to guess how bad it is or? Because it's not good. It's definitely. Uh, it's definitely not good. But you can guess if you want. Uh, let's play two. OK, come on. Give me a little credit. <laughs> Only one Kimmy, and it was that's a safe kick. At 2.5. One. Uh, it's currently 8%. But, but we have had two derailments in the in game day, so it will go down. I'm just trying to get through today, and then tomorrow has got to be a safer day, you know? Gotta be a safer day. 
So yeah, two percent. Yeah. Uh. Gotta be a safer day, right? Right. My goodness, right? Yeah, it's pretty bad, Kimmy. I know. Eight percent. Well. Did I say 2%? I meant 8. It's 8% 8 right now. 8%. But like I said, that's probably going to go down. So I don't know how low it's going to go, but it's definitely uh, definitely going to go down. So, yeah. How low can you go? How low? It's definitely going to go down. And that's crazy. You know, our overall is 82. We can only get tier one contracts. So it's killing us financially. It's killing us financially to have such a bad safety rating, to be honest. Yeah. Yours is zero been like that for a while. Well, I'm glad I'm, I'm, glad I'm not the only one with a bad safety rating. Just saying. Glad I'm not the only one with the bad safety. Because, yeah. Definitely have a bad one. That's alright. Okay, that goes up around the way. The rest of these are sawmill? Yeah, okay. Alright, no big deal. And Trent is right about the diesels, though. The one big advantage of the diesels, when you slam on the brakes, they stop. You know, that is the one the one big advantage of the diesels. But I'm still not going to run them all the time. <laughs> I'm still not going to run them. They have, they have no soul, you know. Just saying. You just send it. Well, that... I can tell by the zero safety rating, yeah. I guess that answers the question. Can the safety rating go below zero? The answer is probably no, huh? Okay. I'm going to guess, yeah. Good. That's right. Okay, uh, are we clear? We are clear. Come on back now, right here. Let's go. Boy, this over here with like, with like, um, less cars, the frame rate sure is nice, isn't it? <laughs> Hi, all. Got to say that. It's all good, bro. It's all good. Dan's here. Hi, Dan. Did you choose Ramless again today, buddy? <laughs> I'm starting to sense a theme from you, Dan. The theme might be violets. I'm just, you know, just throwing that out there. Oh, I got to get the, I got to get the, uh, what's it called? Cars down here, don't I? Yeah, I don't have to right now, actually. Never mind. The pulpwood. Because the other pulpwood cars aren't here yet. So it's going, Dan. How you? How you? How is you? Because those Paul Blood cars weren't ready, and uh, when Trent was ready to leave Silva, and so I told him just to leave them there, and then we would do a a swapsy on those later. So we'll have to do that later. So probably what I'll do is try to get his train over there, and then like send the diesels back with him, or at least like a switcher maybe. Or something we'll see chillin Dan let's go it's the way to be it's the way to be righty but first we must spot cars here at uh, the glorious sawmill we need to get those cars up there too and get some log cars back down here there's so much stuff to do chat at least for now 
on this game. There will become a point later today where I'm like, there's nothing to do. But even then, there's always something to do, so. Yeah. Always something to do. All right, let's give those cars a little bit. Cut this one loose. Because, of course, it goes up around the corner. We don't want it down here at the sawmill with us. Yeah, bone. For the record, uh, uh, those of you that were here last night, it may have taken me uh, forever to calm down, like wind down after last night's stream. And if you know, you know. Um, but it took a while. It took quite a while to wind down after last night's stream. <laughs> last night's stream was wild. Absolutely wild. But anyway, we got some good farming done, right? <laughs> We fed the cows a bunch, you know. So that was good. Definitely was good. All right, let's back this up. Let's go. Come on, come on. Right, I know I'm going too fast, but I'm not kicking them, so it's okay. These cars are controlled. Chaos, but, but controlled, you know? Uh, Definitely controlled chaos going on here, but that's all right. As long as we get slowed down before we crash the bumper, that's all that really matters, you know? There we are, right there. Nailed it. All right, let's go. Let's go. Is that train? That train made it here by now, right? Yeah. Okay, so that train is sitting mainline uh, Whittier. That's fine. We'll go sneak around it with that car, um, which actually we can go set our switch so we can jump around. We'll take the one car and then see what else is there to do. That's not where I want to be. Rats. All right, I bet you that car's there. That train's probably made it up to a lurker by now, huh? Actually, no. Kind of, but not. Not yet. Okay. That's. That other train make it to. Yep. Okay, other trains over at Ella. Chill, 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 chill. Watson boy just resubscribed for 56 months. Watson, welcome back for 56 months. Do appreciate the resub. How's it going? Oh, it's papping. All right, slow down. Not trying to cause any more, you know safety violations here not trying to but i know it's gonna happen i hope not though man i really want a better safety rating i want some better contracts you know just saying discounts on engines and stuff you know better contracts just to make more money to pay back the loan i really don't like having as much of a loan as we have, but it allowed us to, like, you know, buy all those engines and stuff, so. $93,000. Terrible. Just simply terrible. But without that, we don't have, you know, Trent's double diesels, and we don't have four brush tires. It's all good. Where's the set to go? It's a set. Right. 
that car. I think Trent already kind of serviced all this. Oh, well. Then there's that one. But I think Trent did kind of service this already. When he uh, went through here. Which is interesting what Trent will do. He'll grab. This is not bad. It's not necessarily bad. But he'll grab the Silva cars as he's heading to Bryson. Just so they're already like rallied up or gathered up, you know. Which is great, but then you're bringing more cars to Bryson. <laughs> Even less frame rate at Bryson, but whatever, it's fine. It's all good. But it does make sense to kind of just grab them on your way through and be done. You know, you're dropping off some cars, you're bringing some cars back. So it does make sense. Because then the theory is when you go back through with that train, you can just run it. Now, of course, I gave him Whittier cars that spawned over at uh, Andrews. So uh, but that's okay. All right, let's kick this car onto here real fast. Yeah, here we go again, Kimmy. Get ready. Kicking cars. But again, it's only one, and uh, it's fine. Oh, and it just made it past the. You betcha. That was that was the quality kicking right there. Or something like that. Go, train, go. How many people are waiting? 94. Do we worry about that car up there, Chad, or no? That one silver car. Probably should, right? Alright, come on. Really? Wow. I mean, I can stay there as far as I'm concerned. Kind of a pain. Kind of a pain. Alright, I'll leave it there. Come on. By the way, uh, chat, uh, dad was, dad was doing his, uh, Yearly pumpkin seed order. And I guess that was last week or week before or something, but a bunch of us here now. So we have our pumpkin seed for this year. Which I know all of you are thrilled about. Don't worry, I know. I don't know why you guys care so much, but that's cool. Not sure why, but alright. But yeah, pumpkin seed has arrived. You know, before you know it, it's going to be like early June and we're going to be planting, so. Which I actually think we're going to plant a little earlier than normal. Normally, it's kind of like mid-late June. I think we're looking at more of an early June. And I think we're looking a little bit early in October. A little bit earlier in October for having the party as well. Because normally, by the time we have the party, everybody's already gone out and like you know, bought pumpkins and stuff, and then they come to the farm and are like, well, we already bought some. And it's like, now, now, you know? But, uh, yeah, I think we're, I think we're talking about kind of having it just a little bit earlier. Okay, so I got to get these, these cars off of that train. Oh, I guess we could just do it this way, right? Just, like, pop this apart here. Pull these up. Take them off AI, you know, maybe first. Pull this up. And we'll put them on the second track. Might as well just do it here. We got a yard, might as well. All right. Wow, Dan. Wow, Dan. All right. Might as well use these darn diesels. But they're no soul. 
they do stop on a dime though. That is one thing about the diesels. They do they do know how to stop. <laughs> Alright, um, wait, reverse, there we go, I was like, wait a minute. Squirrel Eden 22 cheered Dex 100, woo woo. Dan, thanks to the bits. I know, Kimmy, I know. I do like the bell, though. You can't tell me the bell's not cool. The bell's cool. That's about it, though. Brent would be so mad if he knew I was talking bad about his diesels. <laughs> You're talking bad about my diesels. It's an, it is, yeah, the horn's nice, too. Yeah. But the diesels, yeah, the, I, I tend to get in trouble with the diesels because I full send it way too much. Especially, you see, we got two of the GP9s and then the switcher is what's going on here. So why he's running the, the switcher on a main line, I don't know, but that's fine. If he wants to do that, I don't have a problem with it. Basically, he got done at Silva. And so he hooked everything up and put it on the main line. He actually changed the numbers of these diesels too, so they kind of line up better. So that's a full send in reverse right there. I mean, the acceleration and the braking of these things is incredible. But that's not always a good idea, you know? <laughs> Exactly, Kimmy. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yes, these things are crazy to get up to speed and crazy to shed speed, but it's, to get up to speed is is dangerous. It is very, very dangerous. Uh, but that's all right. It's all good. The tinkle in my pants. Yeah. Squirrel Eden twenty two cheered Dex one hundred. How many bits to full send with a bunch of cars? Ah, uh, Dan, I can't. Dan, I already have a bad enough safety rating. I'm trying to get it better, you know? I can't do that, Dan. Sorry. I can't do it. Thanks for the bits. Um. Black Cat 1 ST cheered Dex 100. Yes, John, how much? <sighs> guys, you can't. You can't. You guys, no. You guys are done. No more. Not allowed. The tinkle in my pants, yeah. Squirrel Eden 22 cheered Dex 100. Top the top guy. Top the top guy. <laughs> ah, but, but, Dan, there's an auto save on this game. There's an auto save, my guy. And besides, the crashes on this game are not spectacular like Railroads Online. For the record. Black Cat 1 ST cheered Dex really 100. You sure you want to do that, Dan? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. But yeah, the crashes aren't spectacular. Literally, the cars just like slide off the track and that's it. They don't fall over. They don't tumble. They don't do any of that stuff. So just keep that in mind. It's really not that impressive. Just saying. It's really not. Not impressive at all. Squirrel Eden 22 cheered Dex 100. I may never financially recover, but I may have to make an attempt. Dan, you can just sign your uh, house over to me, bro. Um, you know what? You got, a, you got a nice Durango, right? You can just sign the title. Send it over. <laughs> Uh, you can just send that to Dan Clancy, actually. How about that? Yeah, just go ahead and send that over to Dan Clancy. Mm, yummy. Squirrel Eden 22 cheered Dex 100. But not right now. I gotta go pick up the child oh. squirrel. 
right, Dan, be safe. We'll catch you. Oh, I do have a car here I have to grab. Dang it, Bobby. I was thinking I didn't have any cars I had to grab. All right, let's run this in on the siding. And then we'll go around it. And back into it. Okay. I forgot I just put that car there. Oh, man. Squirrelidon22 cheered Dex100. John, just work on your breathing exercises and all <laughs> may be okay. All right, dear. <laughs> I was kind of dying last night. I won't even lie. <laughs> I just kind of did hurt. <laughs> it was a little uh, a little overwhelming. Just, just throwing that out there. But we'll catch you, Dan. Have 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 a good one. <laughs> oh boy. What is this? Three thousand thirty six hundred tons right now is what's on this train. Which is not terrible for going to uh Silva. Not terrible at all. Oh yeah. But there's also like, what is it? 57 cars. Need some ketchup up in here, huh? Anyway, it's 95, 98, and then 96, 99. So 95, 98, 96, 99. What's the, what's the, 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 that one? Oh, 13, 18. Okay. I guess he didn't. Yeah, those two. Yeah. I thought it was kind of funny he changed, so they kind of matched. In a way. Oh, jeepers, no, that's not where we want to go. No, 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 no. <laughs> Stop. Not where we want to go. Uh, uh, definitely not. I forgot that switch was okay. Forgot about that one. No big deal. Let me just back up my 57 cars if I can. I can't right now. We're waiting on air. I panicked. I, I should have just used the independent. We would have stopped eventually. All right. No safety rating violation, though. The wrong track doesn't count as a safety way <laughs> violation. Because maybe I do want to go in there. I, I don't, but. You never know. Oh, goodness. That could have been bad. I'm glad I was paying attention to the front of the train and not the back of the train, because, you know, sometimes I do that. So. That could have been very bad. Go flying in there at, like, 18. Oh. Gosh. And Dan would have missed it, too. Would have been a shame. Alright. It'll stop eventually on the independent, so it's fine. Got all this slap between the cars to worry about. Alright. Go, go train. Let's make sure the rest of these are good. Yeah, the rest of these are good. Okay. Golly, man. That could have been bad. That could have been very bad. That's okay. We're making making do. Yeah, I'm out. Now, if I was smart, I would have put that car at the end of the siding so I didn't have to back up, but... Well, I didn't think you had. What else is new? But it is our coal car, so I'd like to get that, you know, refilled as much as possible. Need to make sure we keep some money for that, too. Because we learned that lesson once on here. If you don't have any money to refill your uh, coal cars, they, they just sit there night after night after night. you got to have money in the bank to shout out what you drink, you know? Otherwise, it don't work. Slow down just a little bit here. All right. I'm going to jump around that car. There's nothing to hit in front of us, so... I hope, anyway. All these cars need to go past and then back up a little bit. Oh boy. 
So many cars. So many cars. Sounds like the little deucer's loud, louder than the big. It could be uh, Black Cat. Tomcat? One of you, one of you cats. One of you cool cats. Yeah. It could be. I don't know. To me, they just don't sound quite right. They sound too much like a like a string trimmer, you know? <laughs> they don't sound like a like a big diesel engine running. They sound like a small gas engine. I don't know. They just sound weird to me. I could be wrong, but I don't I don't care for the way they sound personally. But yeah. And like where's like even a little bit of black smoke? Like there's none. Like these things have, have depth apparently, you know. <laughs> Hold on, my train has to regen. Imagine. I know it's not a thing, but could you imagine? Yeah, my train can't move. It has to regen. That would be awful. There's nothing. Yeah, there's nothing out there. Okay. It's like just in case something got left, so like an engine. But nothing out there for us to. And then actually, this train on the front, it has like some Disboro stuff. Locust stuff. Oh, we might just send this all the way up and try to get rid of all a bunch of the cars and then send the engines back out to do that stuff is probably the best option. But at the same time, I don't know if all this can fit. How well all this is going to fit in the interchange there at uh, Silva. Sure, a bunch of it will, but I don't know if all of it will. Way to find out. I mean, on two of the three tracks anyway. Start slowing down here a little bit. Demo. Uh, thanks for that uh, follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? What's happening? Hey, an account that wasn't made five minutes ago. Let's go. <laughs> a real person. No way. We've had some issues with, uh, I would say, bot accounts. It's ever since we played the Lego Fortnite, by the way. I don't know if that means we can't play Lego Fortnite. I don't know. There, There is a huge update coming for Lego Fortnite, though. Gonna add vehicles, which is, like, gonna be so much fun. Just throwing that out there. I wonder if we can put have, like, a vehicle and then put one of the balloons on there. And so when you, like, jump off a hill, you just, like, float. Like, don't make it buoyant enough to just, like, fly, but, like, kind of float. Kind of glide back down like a like a space shuttle. Just saying. That'd be kind of cool. But someday we'll play it again. Actually looking... Oh, there was a huge update to... Or a video that came out today. Um, A huge video that came out today for uh, Satisfactory. Oh, it's already out. Okay, gotcha, Sean. 26. Okay. Old news. All right. Got it. But a video came out today about Satisfactory. I want to talk about I'm sure when Jacob's around later, he'll want to want to chat about that. But it's all about like how they're changing stuff for servers. And how servers are going to work better and servers are going to work different in the future and stuff. So uh, very excited about that because Maybe that means we can actually, I can host a uh, satisfactory server. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, wind this one up. Let's get some uh, green, 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 green. We're going to send it all the way in and then we'll grab the cars that it has to go to like this run stuff after. But we'll go ahead and just get it going. Because once it has momentum going up the hill, it's probably a good thing just to keep it going up the hill. Goodbye. Okay, Have a good time. 
Try not to crash. I do want to wait and flip the switch here so that we can run mainline. Hey. Okay. Bye. Oh, goodness. There's so many cars. 40, 58 now. Yeah, 58. A lot of cars, y'all. All righty. But anyway, so that, that was really cool. We're looking at Captain of Industry is going to have an update coming out, like, what, next week? I might have to jump on that. We'll see. That one's just, it, there's a lot to that game, but might have to jump on there. And then uh, whenever, and I don't know if they have a schedule for Railroads Online to go not in beta. Because uh, I don't know if I really want to play the update in beta. But that new map on there is absolutely beautiful. So I definitely want to play that too. So this, this Railroader might have to... Kind of go to the wayside for some other games here eventually. But we've had a good run on here, you know. We've had we've had our fun. It's a great game. And I'm sure when they come out with uh, some updates in the future and stuff, we'll uh we'll jump back on here eventually. Eventually. Right now the the mission that I have on this game, it's it's a personal one. It's to try to get that safety rating back up to double digits. <laughs> you know, maybe the first digit starts with a five, even, you know, like, <laughs> yeah, maybe 50 would be lovely. If we could get to a 50 safety rating, man, look out. <laughs> Like, that would be incredible, but... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if it's going to happen or not. I mean, you could just, like, cancel all your contracts and, uh... Cancel your contracts and just, like, run passengers and run fast time, right? Literally, <laughs> cancel all work, run passengers, <laughs> and fast time. And that's how you get your safety rating back up. You could probably make that work. It'd be a way to cheat the game. And of course, you're going to run passengers on AI, so you're not going to have any issues. And really, if you wanted to, you could run two or three passenger trains. Probably run two. Maybe even a short passenger train just to go from like Alarka to Alarka Junction and back. And then run two like mainline trains from there. That could be a way to cheat the system though. Hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting. I mean, I would never cheat the system. Oh. Oh, no, no. It would be funny, though. Hey, what are you doing on Railroader today? Running passengers? What about freight? Don't have any. <laughs> Cancel all contracts. I'm assuming you could do that. That would be interesting. Because I know you can cancel your contracts if, like, you don't want to run the sawmill anymore. You can turn it off. That would be hilarious. Anyway. Anyway. All right, so we're going to get these cars spotted in. We're going to grab the log cars and get those going up the hill on AI. And then we're off to work probably to get that engine out of Alarka. We'll work on Alarka mines for a little while. Or maybe we need to go do that engine at Ella, too. There's that car at Ella that needs to be spotted in as well in due time oh come on much breakage yeah, I was wondering if we were going to have enough room there we got plenty of room and 
And then eventually we got to get that big train going out west. Before Brookshire's. Can't wait to see it. It's going to be loud. It's going to be very loud. And yes, we're doing this. It's fine. It'll buff. All right, we can hit the switch. Get the train moving. And just, you know, watch the cars. They're all going to fit here, are they? Well, they don't all fit. Dang it, Bobby. Is there... There's not room for... Yeah, there is room on that track, probably. Dang it. Trying to, you know... Oh, well. Oh, well. Bring the train down. Come on. Full send. Let's go. Full send. Always, always, always. Or wait. That's what gets me in trouble. All back. Trying to be slick and, you know, save a little time. Not room for all the cars. It was close, too. It was, well, kind of. It was kind of close. Okay. Uh, get rid of you. And then we are back against the bumper, so from a little bit of air. All right. This track's not quite back. I don't even think it's going to fit there, honestly. I just have to throw it on the side and wait wait for later. Or just leave it here and we can set for later. Which, that's fine if that's what we got to do. No big deal. Alright, we'll try on this track. I just don't know. I think it's going to work. Got too many, uh, long cars. All right, slow down. That's good. Let's go. All right, back it up. Oh, there is lots of room back here. Never mind. There's plenty of room. I realized there was like a whole car back here. And yeah, we're good. Right on the bumper, but we're we're good by a smidge, so. Alright, forward. And we'll go flip this one while we're here. That's where our train's going next. Yeah, I'm out. Let's go. Go, go, go. The sawmill, it's because you start with the sawmill and it's like your first job. You know, it's like I'm kind of over the sawmill. In a way. And if we had the ability to edit tracks, I would make this track like way longer and connect up there. Just for the record. But you can't do that. That's one advantage to railroads online. Of course, you have to build all the tracks, so. Yeah. Which I'm kind of looking forward to that one. I don't know, um, Tomcat, how much you've played of it or what you think of that new map. But it looks cool, man. That was a little aggressive. But no derailments, so. We're okay. A little aggressive. 
little bit. 